and welcome back. Welcome back, everybody. All right, so we have a set coming up here. It's going to be Charged Ember, the little Mac that we saw in the trailer earlier, the, the short story earlier, um, against the Fox player, Rick. And Rick is coming off of... Who did she play? She, she, ju she lost to Logan. Just really? the last set, yes. Crazy pool we have going here. A lot of rock, paper, scissors going on. Oh, yeah. It's crazy. Like, the, the, the adaptability... We saw just last match. I think the most adaptable player here is probably Mitchell right now. He he was adapting mid-set, and you could see it. It was incredible very good versus Some of the yeah, We're about to see a very fast-paced set here between a Little Mac and a Fox. Rick and Charged Ember. I, I feel like Rick is coming in here with no Little Mac experience. Very little, actually, probably none. Probably none, which could be a detriment. But Victoria has an incredible amount of experience at the sticks, but the Little Mac experience was not there at all. Not there, and that's a big part because playing versus Little Mac isn't like playing versus anybody else. It, yeah, it's it's very different. He has no aerials. He's very grounded. He, he can get through you if you're not paying attention a lot. And of he time. definitely is hitting your shield a lot. You're going to be ready to handle that. Yeah. Anyways, I didn't see what stage they went to, but. Probably yes, too. Yeah. Anyways, if our players are ready, they can get underway right now. Jumping into our first match here, rank and charge Denver. Nolan a fan here. Nolan just having his Victoria trying to open up with a laser. His 22nd birthday was just, what, was it last week? Yeah, just last week. We, we all get a happy birthday for him. Yeah, happy birthday. Wish him a happy birthday. Anyway, we, uh, Victoria is just, she's trying to get in, and it's, it seems like Nolan is just doing what we thought he would do. Like, you have that ground gameplay that just gets through her. And it's, but Victoria keeping the pressure on. It's just so polarizing. So at any moment, both Little Mac and Fox can just rip the stock off. Victoria seems to be looking doing. Aside from that Randy forward stuff, she was camping at the <laughs> KO punch, was very talented. Exactly. And, and just looking through all these landing options, little max, little max, a hell of a time landing. She just needs to get an up smash out of shield here from his uh, his dash attack. I think Little Mac will die again. Maybe now. I think he can die right now. At 119, Little Mac will die to an up smash. Just have to will we see it here? Dash attack. That's all we need to see the win here. We see the stock here. Nice on Victoria tries to get the tech chase read, and she gets the up smash. There it is. Two stocks to two. Nolan up 52%. Charged never here with a big jab coming in. It tries to do an aerial. I don't know what that was. And hopefully we can see some great smash like we're seeing right now. Oh, Charge Dipper trying to go for the two frame. Just goes a little bit too quick, though. I think the, uh, Victoria, uh, Rick has a lot of... It looks like she has a lot of experience. She's platform camping everything he does, but those lasers are just not the best thing to do against Little Mac. And the wake-up F-tilt from the Little Mac, getting the kill. It's looking really tough here. Probably two KO punches between the end of the game and Victoria here. She's got to somehow dodge the big both. Zero percent here. Knocks the oh my god, she is just crazy all over him oh right now. Reads the roll with the up, <laughs> up air. Just needs one up smash and will probably seal the shot. Maybe a few more percentages. Just, oh just my god, she had it there. Man. The up air. One more up air. Oh my god, doesn't get the counter punish. Almost there. Has him in the air. Oh, and clashes with the little Mac air. It's very rare to see that actually. And just unrelenting pressure. Ooh, abuses the super armor on the little Mac F smash. And the KO punch does go through shield. She was not safe. Charge ever going up. One O in that set. What do you think about that charge? I think Charge ever was playing great. He was staying on the ground. He was getting all of his hits. He's in the old one two, you know, like getting those. The you know, he was definitely being dug a little bit, but staying in between, you know, in between the lines of the stage is fine. He can go up as high as he wants. And that's just why this matchup is so polarizing. One minute you see the Fox player getting seventy percent in one like quick, quick combo. Next minute you see Fox dying at like within three hits to Little Mac. If you had to see one adaptation from right here to 
put herself in an advantage? What would it be? It would definitely be to wait out his dash attacks in and hold shield on them. I think just one or two up smashes out of shield. One up smash out of shield. Dash attacks right. Yeah. Haven't seen a single grab come out from him. From either player. Either player. That's all set. And grabs. it's not like they're really looking for the grab. You know, they're they haven't really gave each other a reason to start grabbing. No, because they know nobody's shielded. Everybody's swinging. They're swinging like crazy. Anyways, we're underway into game two. Charged Ember up 1-0 on Rick. Will we see any adaptations here to the Little Mac gameplay? We we already did see her having the platform cap, and she's trying to open up with that laser again. Just getting punished in the exact same way the last and set the started. first grab the whole set from Nolan. Very good. Very. It's almost like he was listening to us. I could. It could have been. Ooh, that was that was quick. The mix up, the run up, do nothing. Oh, oh and reads the jump. The cross of dash attacks. Oh, and can we see? Oh, we don't get a big punish here. Ooh, but actually, I lied. We got we got an up tilt and do up air coming up from Rick. She's just getting rolled on, getting crossed up left and right. She can't quite find the up tilt that she wanted to there. Will she be weary of the tail punch this time? You can't shield it. <laughs> she has learned that she cannot shield that move. And an, an, a, another clash with Little Max aerials. Very rare that we see Little Max and using those aerials. He is making use of what he has. Such a fast and it gets, just gets that punish. Nolan has some of the best movement I've seen him. I, I would I would agree almost very close to the way that Brody Naruto was uh, schmoving earlier. How is uh, how is Nolan's set count? This is his game. Uh, I think um, I'm actually unsure. I think he's lost two games and he's won one. I think. But anyways, we do see him kind of abusing the fact that Victoria has not played against Little Mac ever. Oh, no one, no one. <laughs> we will be getting a report here on no one's current status. Report does not punish the down. These dash attacks are just crazy. It's of what? Oh, this? It's this? Said. It's so oh, wait, not there. Just oh, like one. Oh, it's a throw and dip. Yeah, one, one, two, one. And the KO punch, putting Nolan up to the one. And it's looking great for a hero on her last stop here. One and two, yeah. Yeah. And Nolan is, in fact, one and two. We have confirmation. And we do get to see the up smash coming out on the miss tech there on Nolan. Making her last stop count. She's really lucky. Ooh, she could have got a big combo off that back there. She, oh my, and Nolan is at prime percent to get big combos on him. Victoria with the roll away gets punished on the dash attack though. She's definitely being more careful in the shield now, not letting herself get hit by these big punishes. Oh, and she goes for the grab. Does miss out on the two frame there. Good attempt from Nolan. Down smash on the Oh, and Victoria just misses that punish. Could have been crazy for her. Still, at any moment, she could rip the stock. Just blow it up. She is at kill percent. Rick right now at kill percent on Little Mac. Will she be able to find a stock? She's recovering. She must find a way back in. And voids the F smash. Will we get a punish? She's punishing it. Big punish. Nolan does have the KO punch, and he loses it. Doesn't get it to go to Ooh, the counter coming out at late percent. Doesn't quite kill though. No, and this is last stock, last hit. Will we be seeing that that that, that shield? Uh, the shield uh, we do not see, see the shielding up smash. 
bringing Charged Ember up 2-0, winning the set. I think they they off off screen. I think no, there was no handshake. There was no Victoria handshake. Victoria, is, she is upset. Victoria spit in Nolan's drink. <laughs> she spit in Nolan's drink. We get the man of the hour. All right, get in here. So what what was what was a. Uh, what was going on in that set that just made it really easy to land those uh, the dash attacks, the F smashes? I feel like th this game, this set in particular, so far playing off screen on the other set, I feel like I haven't been like playing it on the ground as much as I should be. But I feel like this game, I was on the ground almost like, the entire time, and when I'm on the ground, I'm winning the fight. Now, exactly. Now, Nolan, as a spectator, one thing. Now those dash attacks rain supreme. But I must ask, where are the grabs coming? You know, like they're shielding it they're, all the time. I feel like you can grab them. You know, start giving them the one two. A total of one grab that entire set. I don't think she was even shielding. No, she was not. It... Uh, I feel like grabbing is just something I haven't uh, practiced enough on. You know, okay. I, I'm just not practicing. You haven't incorporated into your game. I, I get it's sticking fun. with what you're confident with because those dash attacks were looking unparalleled. I think I feel like grabbing is like once I like get to that, it really elevate the mat game. I'll oh yeah, a hundred percent. A hundred percent. Anyways, thank you. Congrats on the game. Thank Good you, job. Thank you, thank you. Um, who do we have up next? We will be right back.